streptococcal disease is an infection caused by streptococcus pneumoniae bacteria, sometimes referred to as pneumococcus. Pneumococcus can cause many types of illnesses, including some that can be life-threatening. Fortunately, there are pneumococcal vaccines available. Pneumococcus is one of the most common causes of severe pneumonia. In addition to causing pneumonia, pneumococcus can cause other types of infections too, including ear infections, sinus infections, meningitis, and bacteremia. Some of these infections are considered invasive. An invasive disease means that germs invade parts of the body that are normally free from germs. For example, pneumococcal bacteria can invade the bloodstream, causing bacteremia, and the tissues and fluids surrounding the brain and spinal cord, causing meningitis. Some streptococcus pneumoniae have become resistant to one or many antibiotics. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention reports that pneumococcal bacteria spread from person to person by direct contact with respiratory secretions, like saliva or mucus. Many people, especially children, have the bacteria in their nose or throat at one time or another without being ill. These people can still spread pneumococcal disease. Anyone can get pneumococcal disease, but some people are at greater risk for disease than others. Children at increased risk for pneumococcal disease include those younger than two years old, in group child care, who have certain illnesses, and those with cochlear implants or cerebrospinal fluid leaks. Adults 65 years or older are also considered to be at increased risk for pneumococcal disease. In addition, some adults 19 through 64 years old are also at increased risk, including those with chronic illnesses, with conditions that weaken the immune system, living in nursing homes or other long-term care facilities, those with cochlear implants or cerebrospinal fluid leaks, and those who smoke cigarettes. These are just a few things to know about pneumococcal disease and streptococcus pneumoniae. To learn more about this or other microbial pathogens, indoor air quality, health and safety, occupational, or environmental issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.